Friday. Hope everyone is ha having an amazing day. As you guys can tell from the title below, this is going to be a What's in My Nanette Lepore Bucket Handbag. If you guys have been following me, y'all know I lucked up on this beautiful bag from TJ Maxx for, I believe, $20 because I told you a little backstory how I thought that a piece was missing from this bag. So, yeah, I did look up and get this bag for an amazing deal from TJ Maxx. And since then, I have not been able to find it again because I do know it's several people still in search for this bag. As well as I'm looking for the other shade of pink. So, yeah, I wanted to go ahead and do a what's in my bag video for you guys because I want to get out of her. I've been carrying her for about a week and she's very delicate. Um, and I don't want to mess up. So, yeah, I want to go ahead and get out of her. So, as you can tell, it is a, the bucket style handbag. It does have a drawstring pull right here, a top handle, and all the metal is in gold. It does not have any feet, but it does have a buck back pocket right here. That's functional. I do carry my phone in that pocket. It did come with this cute heart mirror um, keychain. I got <laughs> stuck for a minute. This is the side. This side. I do have a pretty full. And it's unfortunate because I have to carry a lot of things. However, she does pack a punch she really does but i do not want to mess her up here's the inside i've been on the search for the coordinating wallet and i'm gonna get into that in a minute um i thought i found it last week i think i shared with you guys um i was looking for the coordinating wallet the wallet is in this print right here with the cute little hearts um the wallet i did share with you i returned it so I'm still on the hunt for the coordinate wallet. So let's go ahead and get into it. Okay, the first thing I have is my wallet. This is just my Juicy Couture wallet. The color is very, very similar to this. So I just thought it would be a nice contrast. This is a little bit darker than the bag. And I just have the basics of a wallet, cards, ID, coupons, slot right here for my coins. That's it. I do not have a overstuffed wallet, and I don't have anything back here but one coupon I forgot to use at Bath & Body Works. <laughs> so I have my wallet. Next, I have the Nanette Lepore coordinating pouch. This is the print that I'm looking for in the wallet. I got this from Marshalls. It was $9.99. I'm using this as my bathroom bag. So it has a top zipper here and a zipper here. Here's the bag. I'm not using it that I can remember anything here, but I'm just using it as a bathroom bag. So I just have my Dove hand cream that I got in friend mail from Miss T. Um, my tissues, my Gucci floral roller ball, and a couple female products. So I have that. And let me see what's in this front pocket. You know, like I said, it's nothing in that front pocket, but it is functional. Okay, next I have my Juicy Couture card holder that goes, well, I have to pair with that, but it don't go identical. So it's just your basic Juicy Couture 
card holder. So in here, I just have some business cards. Um, yeah, that's all I have in here. Some business cards, nothing special. Okay, if you can see, this is a two-part um, bag. It has a part here and a part over here. I am done with that first compartment. So these three items was in that first compartment. The middle has a zipper compartment, which you can remove. And inside that middle compartment, I just have my handheld fan. That middle compartment is very, very deep, and it also has pockets on the inside. Um, you have to be really careful with that because if you used to put some items down in that, I'm assuming your things would get lost. Okay, in this back pocket, I have this next item, which is my Juicy Couture Heart Coin Pouch. I absolutely love this coin pouch. And in here... I just have a few lip glosses, which is my Too Faced Injection, um, a lip balm, got from the Dollar Tree, and some hand sanitizer, and I'm carrying champagne toast. Like I said, I just thought that was a nice contrast um, for the bag. Next, I just have my medical bag. Y'all have seen this bag in several of my What's In My Bag videos. I got this from Amazon. Anything that have links, I will make sure I leave it down below. So it just has my band-aids, my alcohol swipes, my eyeglass lens wipes, my on-the-go medication right here, a pink mirror that I got from Dollar General a lighter, some hauls, and a hair tie, and some bobby pins. Just things that I may or may not need while I'm on the go. I am getting ready to finish off my bunker box. If you know what a bunker box is, let me know down in the comments. I would not say what it is until someone to say or until I do actually the video because I am trying to get content together to get ready to show you how I build my bunker box. Okay, got one more item down here in the back of the bag, which is my keys. I told you before, I do not change my keys. No matter what color bag I have, I just do not change it out. It's just, there's just too much. I have this really cute charm right here. My keys and this key pouch. I got this from Amazon as well. That is all that's in the bag. <laughs> so like I said, she does carry a lot, but I don't want to overstuff her because I'm afraid I will damage her leather. Even though her leather is vegan, I still don't want to be too harsh on her. All right, you guys, let me put this stuff together and I will be right back. We have made it to the end of the video. This is all the content that was in my bag. I hope you guys have truly enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend, and I'll catch y'all on my next one. Bye.